Hey everybody, my name is Gunner and welcome back for another video of Total War 3 Kingdoms. Now I hope this time around my voice is going to be okay. Uh, it was on the last video, it was just a little bit too loud, so I uh, we're going to get it eventually guys. We're going to get the right uh, volume, the vo right thing and everything. I'm going to start putting up for every, putting it up for everything really. It's going to be awesome. Um, we've got... Um, Basically, the sound for the volume for the game itself, the volume for the game is going to be way up, way uh, way more up, so you can actually hear a little bit more the game, uh, while still her hearing my voice more than the game, you know, uh, louder than the game. But we'll see how it goes. I hope it's not going to be too, I'm not going to be too loud, and I hope that the game is not going to be too quiet. We'll see how it goes. Uh, when we last left off. We uh, finished a couple of people. We are, uh, on, we only have two more regions or two more people that we are at war right now, uh, with that we're trying trying to uh, deal with. So, let me just uh, get all my stuff. Let me just see really quick what uh, what are the mods I'm using right now. So I've got the mods uh, up uh, done, guys. So I've got the mods right here. Uh, we do have another post available. We're gonna get this guy in this post right here. Or the, uh, equip him to this place. There we go. Uh, upgrading. We got a uh, third administrator basically. Now the game is kind of having a hard time loading and everything. But that's okay. Where are my troops at? That's one thing that uh, I'm trying to figure out right now. So it says uh, it's kind of lagging right now. Unassigned administrator. Shouldn't. We already did that. I had the mods and for some reason the nothing was popping up. All right, so I said in the last video that in this video we were gonna start off with this battle, and that's exactly what we're gonna do, guys. We're gonna start off with this battle. I do want to uh, first though uh, get the new region here, so that's what we're gonna do with this guy. Or did we already move him? Doesn't matter. For me, it's a new video, so we can move him already. Let's go. Let's start moving him up. Can he not move or something? Yeah, he should be able to move, guys. So, I don't know. He doesn't want to move. Fine. Let's get, let's keep him uh, where he is then. I don't know. Uh, let's just start the battle off then. Uh, with uh, my faction leader ver uh, against their faction leader. So, let's go. They don't have any fortress. It's just a city battle or a village battle. Definitely going to beat them. Uh, it's medium versus high though, so it's good. definitely going to be our first battle on video. It's going to be pretty fun. Let's try it out. Let's try uh, and have fun really quick. Alright, look at this region, guys. Look at how it looks. It actually looks beautiful uh, in this region. It has the water side right here. It's a nice fortification with the water and everything. The uh, coastal city and everything. That's really cool. Uh, let's me just see really quick. I think it's just, uh, yeah. I think it's not even a city, it's just um, um, uh, a place where uh, people will go for fishing and stuff. It's a fishing port or something. Alright, I've got three generals in total. I want to see if this guy has... Who's got the basically cavalry? The does come. this guy have cavalry? He does? Yeah, this guy's going to be there with the cavalry, yeah. Alright, so what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to do this right here. I'm going to create my first group, a uh, group of cavalry right here, and I'm going to put them, I guess, on this side, right here. Yeah, I should probably Prepare. put them on this side. Hold yeah, let's just uh, put uh, the cavalry right here, and uh, there we go. So, here goes the cavalry. Now, for the ma uh, range units, I'm going to have uh, all my range units with uh, this guy right here. This is gonna be my general. All my range units are gonna be right here for now. All right, let's just keep him on the side really quick. Um, I'm gonna put them on a group. The rest, the melee units and everything, I'm gonna put them on a group by themselves as well. All right, so the uh, melee units, I want them to be right here. That's gonna be my melee units. Uh, my archers are gonna be right be uh, right behind. We're gonna have this guy, which he's gonna help out with the whole situation. So he's gonna be here, or I should probably put him here. There we go, right in the middle. These catapults are gonna have on their their own group. 
Uh, we're gonna go ahead and use them. I think on this side. Yeah, on this side they're, they're actually pretty closer, please. There we go. So we can have more range, and they're gonna start attacking. We've got uh, my other general. So this general right here, I want to keep him. Same thing right here. And uh, let's go. Let's start this shit up, guys. I'm confident enough. They've got archers. They've got everything. My catapults, I want them to start shooting on the towers. Alright. Actually, this this one is going to uh, shoot there. And this one is going to shoot there. And you're going to see we're going to do a lot of damage with my catapults right here. Um, my melee units are going to start moving a little bit. Just a, just a little bit right here. And uh, my archer needs to move as well, you know. They need to obviously move. Uh, let's see real quick. I, I want them to be behind my uh, my melee units. So let's just keep them behind like right there. And same thing for these two generals. Let's keep them moving while my catapults are moving. Or attacking. They've got three generals in total. But this is going to be an easy fight. Uh, all we need to, take, uh, to do really is uh, to take care of this... Uh, this whole thing my cavalry i'm probably gonna try to get behind them or try to attack them from this side or something there's actually an entry point right here um that's available so i'm gonna what i'm gonna do is i might just there we go right there put my cavalry right here attack from this side while my uh my melee unit units uh, punch right through uh the enemies so the towers are destroyed. We're gonna go ahead and start attacking with my catapults. Attacking the soldiers now, the armies. All right, this is gonna be pretty fun. Let's go. Uh, my my melee unit. We're gonna start moving again. All right, it's gonna continue to move. And same thing for my archers. My uh, stuff like this, stuff like this, generals. We're going to do this slowly, but surely we're going to do this the right way. What about my cavalry? They're fine. They're not getting attacked right now. They're getting in formation. Uh, I want to attack from this side. So what we're going to do, we're going to form, uh, do a formation for my cavalry right here. Uh, they're getting attacked, but it's fine. They're doing fine. And let's continue to start moving up. Let's continue to start moving, guys. Everybody move 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 uh, We've got uh, these two my my leader right here my other leader Right here my catapults now my catapults. I really need them to shoot uh, I, I need them to destroy the the enemy archers really that's what I need to destroy the most is the enemy archers so catapults are gonna fire at them and I think what we can do it's probably start attacking from this side. Let's go. We're going to do a, a charge here. We're going to do a, a, a charge. Probably a bad idea. Because there's one of their generals right here. But uh, I'm confident enough, guys. Let's do it. Let's try it out. Let's go. Charge. You got this. Charging right into their uh, militia. Mountain militia and everything. That's a good charge in itself. We're gonna go ahead and do this and we're gonna challenge this guy we're gonna challenge him see if he accepts i think he did accept yeah he did accept so there's gonna have a duel between these two let's go guys let's attack the uh, these bad boys we got uh, my cavalry doing doing the deed right now while my melee units are still moving up all right i want you guys to be on guard right here amazing that you they're starting to move up all right, so you guys know what to do you, you shoot and my catapults are gonna start shooting uh, on these guys right here Actually, one of my catapults is gonna shoot on the on the big horde right there that's coming in You can uh, do that. All right, you got this guys. Let's go These guys are fighting it off my two uh, Generals uh, the two generals are fighting it off. I think my general right here is losing which I don't like but it is what it is, guys. We got this. We got this. Come on. You, you can win. You can win. 
You got this in you, buddy. Rage. Rage, rage, rage. There we go. It's, uh, the other guy is much better than us. We can already see that uh, from this side. All right. Uh, good. Let's continue, guys. Uh, attack. At, uh, actually, attack the, uh, the these ones. And uh, you know what? Yeah. There we go. We've got the catapults for a reason. This is why they're here. Uh, we're gonna challenge or oh, can't challenge them because they're they're sissies. They don't want to fight on duel. Uh, this guy's not doing too well right now. Come on, you got this. My ca uh, my cavalrys are not doing too good, so we're just gonna we're gonna retreat for now with my cavalry because it's not doing too good right now. Yes, we're doing a great job though with our actual archers, you know. That's really good. Yeah, we're doing an awesome job with my archers. We're doing a big time damage. I'm going to go ahead and tell my ta catapults to uh, take care of these archers and tell my other catapults to take care of that, um, that strategist, that leader. And uh, my, my leader right here is going to go take care of this guy because uh, he's going to be a problem otherwise. Let's go, guys. Boost up right here. My other general is having a really bad time right here. He should probably run away, but I mean, he's not totally the last. He can still do this. It's just, I don't know, guys. I feel like he's going to lose that battle. It was just a big distraction. I feel like he's definitely going to lose this battle. So I'm kind of scared right here. I don't want to lose him or anything. You know, I would be pretty stupid to lose someone like him. Uh, she's uh, she's running away, so what I'm gonna have to do? I'm gonna have to go after her. Let's go, chase her, uh, chase her off, and I'm gonna have to uh, take care of this bad boy. You guys got this. You st you guys start moving. Actually, you start you start moving, and uh, same thing for the archers. Start moving again. There we go. Start moving, all of you. All right, you. You got this. You can beat him. Let's go. I believe in you. Yeah, my cavalrys are just going to chase them off. And my catapults are going to continue to fire on the rest of the enemies, really. I think I won. I won. Nice. My general won, guys. That is awesome right there. All right. Let's go. Continue assault. your assault, buddy. Continue to uh, chase them after. We're, we're winning this battle big time. This... This is a victory already. We won the battle. Now it's just a matter of killing the generals, getting rid of the generals. This is the uh, the actual leader right here. So if we could probably take and take care of these uh, these uh, bad boys. All right. You know what? Everybody, start shooting at him. Everybody, uh, yeah. Everybody, attack him. Attack him. And uh, you guys are just gonna yeah, continue to bombard against this place. Uh, the ones that are fleeing right now, I'm gonna attack him. That's the one thing we want to do right now is attack the um, their leader, kill their leader. Let's go. Let's see that guy. It's really quick. How it looks. This must be uh, ridiculous, man. Look, he's encircled and everything. He can't do shit against us. You really can't. Let's go. Everybody gets a boost too. Let's go, guys. You can't do shit. Attack him. There we go. He's gonna die in a couple of minutes. Should die the leader and everything. What about the others? Uh, we're still gonna chase after them. We're still running away. Run away. I think we killed the. Uh, I think my leader killed uh, whoever was there. Yeah, a victory. I killed the... Uh, so the leader is dead. Their leader is dead. We're gonna claim the victory. Doesn't matter. That was the last uh, area they they had. So we killed our leader. Take, uh, took their place. Uh, took their last region. And now it is time to move on to the next area. Uh, I don't know how many we lost. Uh, we lost quite a bit of... Um, I, it did a bad job with the uh, cavalry. That's the one place where I've got really good melee units and really good archer units. But it's just my cavalry. I've got good cavalry. It's just I didn't use it properly. I just 
went and wasted them on this battle. I I need to uh, use them in a better way. All right, here we go, guys. Taking over the this region right here. Really good battle. We lost 300 soldiers. Unnecessarily, uh, I feel like we could have lost. We would have lost a more if it was uh, for other resolve. But I still feel like I could have done better than uh, losing 300 people. You know, I kind of went uh, all berserker mode with my cavalry, and that was not good. So we killed the leader. They've got a new leader, but it doesn't matter because they don't exist anymore. So that's pretty much that. Uh, our leader got a boost, which is really good. We're gonna need to reform our army, though, because we took a, we took it took a toll on us that uh, battle. Let me see really quick. Authority, maybe. It's either authority or resolve. I'm gonna go for authority here. This one looks like a really good one, so let's get the all the authority possible. Uh, there is uh, another boost for someone, or uh, for this general, of course. He. You want to battle one on one, even though you were starting to lose at the end. He managed to uh, to win it, to overcome his uh, his weaknesses. So that's really good. I'm really happy uh, happy about that. We're gonna go ahead and give him expertise right here. Really good for him. All right, up next again. I think we can uh, start to. Let me just see real quick. Okay, so we already have this region. I think we can start moving up uh, here and uh, just skipping the next turn. Let's go. All right, so this guy wants us to be in a coalition uh, with the deposed uh, tyrants. With the, he's with Simidai already. Uh, I cannot negotiate, so I'm just going to refuse uh, directly. If he can't give me anything in exchange for that, there's no point. I want territory in exchange for um, trades and stuff. You know, that's what I want, so... He can't give me anything. There's no point in, uh, for me to uh, to do anything for him. You know, I won't. I won't get into a coalition for no reason. I'm. Just, I'm looking to get a peaceful. Even though I'm at war right now and I'm basically destroying f factions, that's not what I really want to uh, do uh, on my list. But I want to try to be the go the peaceful route and try to annex people instead of just literally attacking them and stuff. I feel like it's a waste of time to attack them. You can um, really just do this the right way and just annex them the smart way. Exploiting connections. The other princes of Jin know you have to do, uh, know you to have the emperors here. Uh, they implore you to convince him to issue a decree that raises their allowance. Allowances. Such a request is transferably self-serving. Yes, it is, uh, yet it is undeniable that you uh, too could benefit from this. Refuse. Do it for yourself. Do it for the princes. Uh, popular. I'm going to do, do it for the princes. Sure. Why not? Why not, right? I'm, I'm just going to make friends. What do you wish, my lord? It's all good, really. Uh, now, the population is not happy here. We're going to need some sort of thing that's going to give us... Happiness. I'm not sure what it's going to be. We're going to have to figure it out eventually. We're going to start moving up. No, we're going to we have to wait for this army. Now, his army, this leader, is moving up here. Probably going to start attacking us either here or here. If he attacks our army directly, I feel like he's going to die. So he should probably not do that. But uh, I'm not him, so I can't tell him what to do, really. Uh, let me see real quick. We've got level 5. What should we do? I think we should get that. There we go. Next up, do we have... we got so many territories now. I think we should get something for support. Or uh, noble support. Yeah, a hen. A hen should be really good. That's going to help us out. Tongue hen. Uh, we're going to get that. I guess this is the only thing we can get right now. Let's more move up our army, guys. Move it up. Let's go. We're gonna take out this little small town right here on the on the coast, on the little uh, coast right here, close to Tai uh, Taiwan actually, really close to Taiwan. We're gonna move up to Taiwan before moving up to these. I really want to get that coast, island. So we got the city. Uh, we got the town right here. We're moving up, guys. Look at this. Our um, 
Our region of expansion is really good. I'm really hoping that we're going to get all of this for ourselves. That would be pretty great if we could get our hands on all of that. Let me just see reform. We, got a, uh, we need a new one. We're just going to go for this one right here. Here we go. Uh, next up, yeah, we can't move these guys really because they they kind of need to heal up. So I'm going to let them heal up really quick. Uh, I need my army to get itself together again. How many? I've got two childs, two sons. So we're still doing great. All right, we're good. I think we're good. Let's continue, guys. All right, this guy wants us to be in the military alliance with them. And they refuse, like always. Like I said, I'm ke I keep saying it, but it is how it is. You can't give me anything in return in terms of territory. I'm not uh, I'm not interested in military alliances or coalitions. I'm not interested in any of that. Because if I do that, I'm going to get caught up in a bunch of war random wars. And I prefer doing my own wars on my own terms. Alright, and uh, that's pretty much it. Alright, so we're in the next turn, guys. Now, there is one thing that is kind of threatening to me is um, this guy, his army, right? This is the leader of the only, basically the, uh, the last leader I need to kill. And uh, he's kind of uh, scary a little bit. He's starting to move up. I'm pretty sure he's going to try to attack uh, Guangu, the limb lumber yard, first. And uh, I need to move up my army quick because otherwise he's going to attack me. And that's not going to be good for anyone. Uh, I can upgrade my other general now. I'm going to give him some resolve probably or expertise. Let's just continue to give him expertise, I guess. Uh, I'm going to... Are, are they good? All right. They're, every unit is there. They're not fully healed up, but we need to move, guys. We at least need to move to uh, this place right here just to make sure that everything's fine. So that's what we're going to do here. We're going to move up, uh, move back up into the city right here just to make sure they don't take care of us. Oh, they won't be able to. Yeah, I won't be able to to move uh, fast enough in order to in one turn to get to this city anyways. So I can intercept them if they ever plan on getting uh, here or there. They won't have enough. They have probably enough to attack me here. That's why I moved my units here. Uh, let me see real quick. All right, these guys. I need to upgrade my towns real quick. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Uh, we have bo more bonuses. Sure, let's get more uh, noble support. Always good to have that. Uh, upgrading my towns. Continue to do that. There's a level 2. I'm going to get it to level 8. Sure, level 8. But not level 8, but level 3. 8 uh, noble support. I'm going to get that real quick. Uh, some prestige. And anything else? I don't think so. I think we're good. I think we got everything we wanted. We're going to move up to Taiwan now. Start moving up on the seas, guys. I uh, really want to get my hands on that island before anyone else does. Let's go. Start moving up. We're on the sea now. That's really good. Start moving up right here. I think the way it works, I can't uh, get all the way there. Can I get? Yes, I can. I can get to the island. Good. There's a certain pathway. Like, see the X on my uh, my controller or whatever here? I can't. That tells me that I can't move there. So let's attack the uh, Yizu Highland right here. And get this deserted place. Get this, uh, get this island for ourselves. There we go. A call to arms. As war grows, lines are drawn. Good. Good, good, good. So, we've got this. We're going to uh, build it up. We're starting to get uh, our hold on Taiwan right here, which is really good. You can see here uh, Korea and everything. It would be pretty cool if you could expand like a nice DLC. I know it's all about China, but... Can expand at least the regions here and you know Korea and everything, maybe a little bit of Japan. 
would be pretty cool to insert Japan in here. That would uh, actually be really awesome. We got a, a spy that we can get here. So we're going to deploy our spy, I guess, onto our, our places that I don't know anything about, right? I know everything, basically, at this point. So probably just there. Huh. What about, yeah, what about him? Just him. Just activate a spy and uh, see what he's up to. All right, we're good. I can have another spy, but I don't want to buy a spy itself. So let me just do that research really quick. I think we're good. Let's continue to move on, guys. We're uh, moving nicely, pretty nicely and quick with this thing. The U River. This is a beautiful river right here. This is where we uh we faced up with this thing. This is what it looked like. All right, let's see what they're uh, they're gonna do, guys. Here, this is the moment, and there are march too, so we definitely can uh, get them by surprise here if they do a mistake. Okay, so here's a thing I can negotiate with: a Simamu, which wants uh, to pay us for a non-aggression attack. Let's see if we can get a territory out of them. It's pretty far from us, so I can't get a territory out of them. Yeah, because of that. That's kind of a problem. All right then. Uh, he's willing to give us money. I don't care about money, and uh, so he can't give us anything. I'm sorry, buddy, but there's no point in us having a non-aggression pack if you're not even close to me or not anything. Most of these um, alliances or these trade uh, that uh, most of the factions wants to do with me. They're all too too far away from me to do anything. You know, I can't trade through anything for uh, with them really. Okay, let's see where Guzen went uh, this time around. I'm gonna go slowly with these messages in case I'm missing something really important here. One of my brothers is gonna end up die, guys, uh, dying. We got another noble birth, really good. Overpopulation. That mission is done. Uh, field surgery. Okay. A potential traitor. One of your courtiers has loudly and dramatically denounced uh, one of his opponents as a spy. In private, the accused admits this fact, but begs protection in exchange they will give you valuable secret information. Protect them. Execute them. We're fucking traitors. We're executing traitors, guys. We don't leave them alive. What kind of shit is this? Alright. We're good here. Yes, uh, I'm actually see. I, I want to see my newborn baby. So it's this guy right here. It's another boy. We've got uh, three sons so far. Really good. So this guy did not move. Decided to not move. Recover his troops instead. Interesting choice. Uh, all the way, all the good, better for me. I can actually start moving up on him. I'm gonna attack him right away, guys. Take care of the leader. And once they're taken care of. We're going to be good for days, so I guess this is the only one that uh, could be good. Um, I'm going to guess the Confusion Temple or whatever. All right, let's go. Let me see real quick right there. Uh, all this. Um, level 4 here, so that's all level 3. There's a level 2 right here. I'm going to upgrade that. What about uh, this one? I can't do anything, okay. Uh, Gensha level 5 so I can upgrade anything really so I'm just gonna upgrade this one to the to a uh, uh, noble support over here Luling we're gonna get I guess we uh, we kind of upgrade the uh, the town a little bit here uh, Tonghan we're gonna upgrade it I guess we could upgrade it to this we already have the hen we're gonna have uh, one of these right here, so noble support definitely, and uh, yeah, I think we're good. Let's move up first with our uh, our army right here. Uh, we gotta upgrade that, actually upgrade our our town. Let's move up, get the next region right here, get the the f the fishing port itself. Very good. Continue to move up. Every time it's just with this army, it's lagging a lot. Um, I've uh, noticed so it's just every time I'm moving this army in particular it's lagging a lot the other army that I have with my main leader is not it's not lagging with him so I don't know why it's lagging with di this army in particular but oh well let me see real quick get uh, all these research researches done all right so now that all this is done 
and actually see where we are in terms of Grand Prince. We're getting there, we're not quite there yet, but uh, we're on our way there, I guess. Alright, let's continue, guys. We're almost fully healed up, so I feel ready for another, another big battle. Definitely feel ready. We have to take care of them before they start to attack us somewhere, uh, one way or another. We gotta do it. So let's just attack them uh, before they do attack us, you know. So balance power, it looks like they're, they uh, they have the win here, the advantage. But not for long, alright. We'll do this battle on the next uh, uh, video, like I did uh, on the, for this one. So I'm saving this one. High casualties, it says for us. They've got 3,000 soldiers. Um, only three generals, though. It looks like, yeah, only three generals. Uh, they've got the garrison for the city, which is kind of pretty weak. And they've got this, which it's defeatable. Definitely defeatable. I've got catapults as well, which they can take care of a lot of these enemies. Uh, the men surrender. They won't obviously do that. All right, so... I'm gonna starve them out. Starve them out, and uh, we'll see you guys for this battle. On the next video, we're gonna do another big battle uh, of leader versus leader. We'll see how it goes. Hopefully, uh, we'll be fine. So, remember to leave a like and subscribe if you didn't enjoy the video. I'm gonna see you all for the next one. Keep it easy, guys.